Good morning, good morning. Welcome to 4 by 8 Paper Stuff. This is Beth. We are on our way to Peru on a train. Well, we aren't, but Michael Palin is. This is his journey from 1997 of going around the Ring of Fire around the Pacific Ocean, and he is now entering from Bolivia to Peru. Yesterday, or the other day, I made zucchini bread, and this was the very last of the parchment paper roll that I had. So, of course, it can't be thrown away. It needs to go in a journal. And he's on a train, and it's um, high altitude, and he's not sleeping. It's cold, blah, 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 blah. So he's rather short with his words. And I decided to just print some Peruvian images of their textiles because I love textiles and I love, love, love all the colors in the Peruvian textiles, any South American textile. And a street scene and a llama scene, which happens a lot. He's The first town he goes to is Cusco. So his journaling is day 184, train travel. Along our route, Inca civilization was born. Manco Capac, Capac, son of the sun god, and Mama Aklo, daughter of the moon, rose from the waters of Lake Titicaca. Eventually, they reached a place that they called Cusco, the navel of the earth, and it became the Inca capital. I thought that was poetic and pretty and fitting for where we are. And... I had these images that I just wanted to kind of splash around, but I that was way too easy and way too boring for me. Now, I could have put paper underneath them and kind of framed them out with little pieces of collage because I've got lots of tiny little bits here. But I decided to go about it at a different rate. Um, I put a little bit of Stabilo all around the edges, and then I got the idea that in that upper right hand picture is a street scene and there's a lot of wrought iron on windows and doors and I thought, well, what if, could we make some wrought iron abstractly around the edges here? And I put an arrow because like here comes the rest of Peru. Um, so I did that with Stabilo All and Stabilo Woodies and I, it's very abstract, very, very, very generic, very, very simple. But I like it and I used red and green because there's a lot of vibrant reds in these textiles and colors throughout the South America area. And the turquoise reminds me of some of the turquoise jewelry that I know is in our Southwest and I'm pretty sure it's in South America too. I know there's jade down there. Um, so anyhow, I'm going with turquoise and red and there's turquoise, lots of turquoise colors in their yarns and their textiles. So we're doing all of that. And so this is my abstract wrought iron on our way through exploring Peru via Michael Paland and his journey in 1997. This is fun. And we have a yucky day today here because we have a tropical depression out on the East Coast Ocean. The, I believe that's called the Atlantic, another language. But um, it's, it's just making it super... Okay going to go get gas um anyhow so it's just making it super moist and muggy and damp and yucky here um yucky is a technical term and so I decided on the inside of this cover I could put my original um game plan which I have swayed from tremendously already but I like having that in there and it's kind of like an additional piece to my journal and I like that so, thanks for watching. I'm excited to be in Peru, and I will see you all tomorrow in Cusco.